So we need to find the null space of the given matrix. Uh, we will solve uh, AX equals zero equation using Gauss-Jordan reduction method. So we will start by writing down the augmented matrix, which looks like this. So here we have zero, zero, zero. Um, and we will do that by performing row operations. So the first row operation is we subtract row one time, times two from row two. So row two becomes row two minus two row one. And then we get row one is the same. Row two is uh, zero, zero, negative one, negative three, zero. And here row three is the same. Our next step is uh, uh, we add row one to row three. So instead of row three, we will get row three plus row one. And here our matrix look like one, one, negative one, two, zero, 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 negative one, negative three, zero. And here we get zero, zero, negative one, negative three, zero. Next step is we subtract row two from row three. So row three becomes row three minus row two. So the first two rows are the same. I'll just copy paste them. The third row is all zeros, zero, 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 zero. Next step is we uh, subtract row two from row one. So we get that row one becomes row one minus row two. And here we get one, one, O, oh, five, O. Oh, and two last rows are the same. Okay, next step is we multiply row two by negative one. So here row two becomes nev negative row two. So we get one, one, oh, five, zero, 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 three, five, zero, 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 zero. Well, now we can, uh, uh, we can solve this uh, by writing this down as one, one, oh, five, oh, oh, three, five, oh, oh. O, o times x1, x2, x3, x4 equals zero. Then we'll write this down as a system of, of equations. So it's x1 plus x2 plus 5x4 equals zero. Then um, 3x3 three, three, three three plus 5x4 also equals zero. Um, oh, wait, I think I made a mistake. Oh, sorry, here we have one, f one, three. And here we have one, three. So it's uh, x three plus three x four. Sorry about that. So here x two and x four are free variables. So we will set x two equals uh, alpha and x4 equals beta and we have that x1 equals negative alpha minus 5 beta while x3 equals negative 3 beta. So the null space uh, of matrix A contains all vectors of the form negative alpha minus 5 beta alpha negative 3 beta and beta transpose so this equals alpha times negative 1 1 0 0 transpose plus wait let me move this a little plus uh, beta times uh, negative 5 0 negative 3 1 transpose and and uh, alpha and beta are rational are real numbers so yeah this is the null space which we were looking for